It's show and tell time! Here at the Collector's Corner, we take something out of our toy chest, something out of our video game case, something off our comic book shelf, and we present it to the world. It could be worth millions of dollars or just sentimental. What do you guys got? Yeah! It never fails. No, 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 I'm not showing. <laughs> it never gets old. For those for those that are just listening on the podcast, Jack has once again pulled out his Wolverine claws. Jack, you're gonna have to do this every episode now. I can't do it every episode. <laughs> Man. It's gonna be it's so old. Man, but it's these are still visually cool. And my yeah. facial hair is growing out a little better for uh, it. You looking like Wolverine, man. You and since like... I've just cut in here, I'll go first. <laughs> <laughs> that joke was just as bad as the one we paid him for. <laughs> <laughs> this week, I'm showing off my original oh. Sony PlayStation. Oh, oh my goodness. Me neither. You, you never had one? What? No, I never no. had the first one. I played yours, Rich. I never had the first one. Yeah, yeah, but you yeah. played it. So there are a handful yeah, of, of consoles out there that, in my opinion, changed the game. Obviously, there was Genesis, the Genesis yeah. when that came out. There was the Super Nintendo, which changed the game. And this bad boy right here, the Sony PlayStation number one, just changed the Was game. Was that the first like laser disc console? That's the first CD Holy video God. game. And then, well, Sega CD no, was Sega, yeah, right. Sega yeah, Sega CD, CD did come Sega out. CD. Yeah. And did they have went, another one, another adapter that went on Sega before? Yeah, or, or, it, it went yeah. on top of it. Yeah. Mm. And you can't have one of those guys without the memory, memory cards. cards. Oh, yeah, you didn't yeah. have the memory cards, you, you had nothing. And on this memory card, I've got Final Fantasy VII saved. Yeah, all right. And Breath of Fire, two wow. great games. Nice. Are these? Is this your original PlayStation from back in the day, Jack? That's it, right there, and the Ooh, cards. Wow, dude, does it That's still work? Impressive. You still play it? Last time I plugged it in, it still works. Yeah. Oh, you don't have to. You don't have to cross your fingers. Like, hopefully, you get the the right screen. Well, sometimes it doesn't close, but you put a book on it. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All oh, right, man. Nice, Chris. What do you got? So I want to go back. I'm gonna, so we talk a lot about McFarland, and uh, before McFarland, we had DC Direct. So this was actually DC Direct, not Mattel, like I showed a couple weeks ago. So I want to show my, and this is going to go along with the debate, but I want to show my 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 oh, Dark Knight shit. Rises, give it away, Batman, and right. then my Dark Knight Rises, Superman figures. What's he got on his hand? Yeah, there? What it's it's Batman's oh, it's, cowl. It's the cowl. Uh, I was like, was a boxing glove? Nah, it's Batman's cowl. He ripped Wait, it, it. These are from where? These are these are these are DC Direct. Oh, okay, okay. Because this is the McFarlane one. The McFarlane one. Yes. Yeah, so the McFarlane two pack has bad the armored Batman and the Superman. So it's nice to see kind of uh oh, cool. Yeah, the difference between the the DC direct one and the McFarlane one. So obviously if you do an unboxing, can you I mean if you do a review of that, can you com compare it to the DC absolutely. direct figures? Yeah, absolutely yeah. I will. Yeah. Absolutely I will. But it's pretty cool. Nice. Honestly, I, the sculpt is that's the, what I was saying. Yeah, the sculpt is is you know what? When I do the unboxing, it's hard to, to hold it with because it's still in the package. When I do the unboxing, we'll have a comparison of the sculpt because even though the DC Direct didn't have the articulation, the sculpt on them were was sculpt was pretty good, man. Yeah. Right. Look at that, look at the expression on their faces. It's, it's pretty cool. That's pretty dope. Yep. Well freaking done. Is there an S on the back of that cape of 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 the? Uh... Come on, man! Wow. Come on, man! Come on! Come on! Come on. I don't think, think there's one the in the one. I don't believe so. I don't think so. It's, not, I, uh, it's, it's tough for me to tell. I don't know. I'll let you guys. I will do a video this week on it, and I'll let you guys know. Mm -hmm. Well done, Rich. What you got, yeah. man? What you got, man? Listen, because we're doing Star Wars. I mean, I got a lot of Star Wars pops up there. <laughs> 
But that's all like Mandalorian Boba Fett stuff. But yeah, I did so, pick up. He did a subtle flex. Did he just did a subtle yeah. flex? That was amazing. <laughs> like, hey, man, he's he's like Chris can't have all the praise today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I picked up these joints. I picked up like two of these, not of the same one, but of, of different characters. But um, yeah, GameStop had an exclusive of pops for uh make a wish make a wish oh, day nice. world make a wish day 2021 oh, wow. so i got the stormtrooper fantastic oh, that's dope. Um, is, it, is it blue or silver it's, hard it's like me. blue like a bluish silver like a metallic uh, blue yeah Bluver. Like make a wish oh, yeah. is a great program my uh my wife's cousin was a, is a make well he is a make a wish kid but he's, oh, he's wow. yeah he's he's uh he's good now so he's out of the program so it's not just for kids who are you know Towards the end, sometimes just kids who are struggling with sickness and cancer, and yeah. it gives them some hope and you know to help them fight whatever they have to fight. So wow. it's a good cause. Wow, you know, I, I I try to donate when I can. Um, usually in a store when they're like we're donating to cancer, I'm like yeah, no problem because I got a few family members that also dealt with cancer, um, and one passed away from. So you know, mm-hmm. if a little bit helps, I, I help out. But yeah, Absolutely. not only help out, but also got a dope figure. That is you sick, know. man. That finish on that is fire. Yeah, yeah. I want to find another fire. one so I could take one out of the box and just have it out. But you know, yeah. there we go. This is the only one that was left in the store, so that was that. Cool. Nice, How's that, man. Nice, man. Me, I just did an unboxing of these, but I want to show them here on Collector's Corner. First up, I have. I showed you guys this a couple of weeks ago in the beginning, but um, that the Rock. Yeah, I, I love figure. Dope. Yo, real talk, this is the best head sculpt McFarlane has ever done for a live action uh, movie. Man, Looks just like the freaking still. rock. I mean, I'm sure he has something to say about it. And just the detail on that cape. I mean, it's mad heavy, so this dude does, does not stand. Without of course not. It's McFarlane, so you can't oh expect it to pass. But then I'm like, yo, if you're not going to put him in a movie together, I will. <laughs> so I also Whose right. head sculpt is that one? This is actually based off the comics. I was gonna say because that don't look like him at all. Yeah. No, this is based oh. like kind of like John Cena a little bit, if you ask me. It was <laughs> really. It's actually really kind of weird to put them both together because one is so clearly the actor and the other is the comic. Right, but I still think he looks real enough. I don't know. We'll have to see how they look on the shelf. But this is such a dope figure, man. I love the detail on this Shazam. I think Shazam is like the ultimate wish fulfillment for kids like you say a, a name you get to be big and strong and if the movie won't put them together i will <laughs> nice. yo i saw a i forgot where it was at either facebook or instagram but a guy got the the first rock um black adam without the cloak and everything yeah he yeah he painted it and when I tell you, it was like movie accurate. Oh, they he put out the details. The details on the yeah. face, the costume. I was like, yo, that is dope. <laughs> yeah. There's some people that are really because all the all the um all the detail is here, man. Like you can see it in his boot and in his cape and stuff. But like yeah. you said, when you when your dude did like the 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 finish or you, yeah. you just, yeah. it just brings it out, just brings That's all the cool. texture out. But those are my figures. That's my pickup. What's up, y'all? Welcome to Three Brothers and a Shot of Milk. We're talking.